Hello everyone. In this video clip, I'm going to show you a web page data input using Google Mathematica. We are going to perform robust and automatic data integration on the Malaysian Institute of Road Safety Research, VIRUS, where we are going to obtain statistics and accident characteristics involving motorcycles in Malaysia. These are the outline to the topics that I would like to discuss in this video clip. First, extracting HTML data. Processing the different data formats into number formats. Then, combining all the data into a table. Plotting various graphs with the data on different accident characteristics. Next, determining the correlation between these accident characteristics. And lastly, combining all the processed information into a manipulative palette. In the first part, we are going to extract the statistics and accident characteristics involving motorcycles in Malaysia. Import the HTML page that contains the data needed. Next, import only the data. Then, extract the data of the specific form, where in this case, it is of string for 10 times. Arrange them column by column, where here, we will obtain a suppressed output. In this next section, we're going to process the different data formats into number formats. The accident characteristics are year, registered vehicles, population, road crashes, road deaths, serious injury, slight injury, index vehicles, index population, and index VKT. In this part, we will combine all the statistics and accident characteristics in a tabular form. As we can observe, all the statistics are arranged according to the year and other accident characteristics. In this next part, we are going to plot graphs of different accident characteristics. Our first graph is a plot on population versus year. The second graph is a plot on population versus road crashes. The third plot is a graph on registered vehicles versus road crashes. And the last graph is a plot on road deaths versus road crashes. In the next section, we are going to determine the correlation between these accident characteristics. These codes are the calculation to obtain the correlation coefficient. These codes are to obtain the correlation matrix in tabular form. In this last part, we are going to combine all the processed information into a manipulative palette. As we can observe, we can operate between different plots and the correlation coefficient. 